Hey everybody, um, today I have an unboxing of this new Bright RC buggy. It it's, looks pretty cool, um, although usually with these, these aren't the best, but hey, they're fun to mess around with. So, quick look at the box here. There are two different kinds you can get. I got this one here. Um, it does say that it takes seven AA batteries and that it can run for up to 45 minutes. So, let's get it open here. Alright, so we we'll open up this side. We've got a owner's manual. And it slides out. Alright, now let's take a little closer look at that. Um, got the controller here and got the RC car. Um, seems to be zip tied in, so let's see here if we can get it out. And that frees the car and the transmitter from the box. All right, so I don't know if they sent any uh, little plastic things to hold these remote or the antennas up. I'm sure they did. I'll have to look at them here. But let's take a closer look at this. All right, so here's the car. Um, it has a little bit of suspension on it. Um, the wheels are a little loose, but we'll see how that works out. Um, underneath, we got the battery compartment and a uh, little trim knob there. This runs off of 27 megahertz. And uh, the car itself takes five AA batteries and the remote takes two. So let's get the batteries in here quick and see how it runs. All right, so here's a close up of the remote. It basically looks like it's gonna be just forward, backwards, and left and right. And it doesn't feel like there's any proportional controlling on this. Um, seems just like it's going to be uh, buttons inside of it which I may take it apart later and look inside but yeah I mean it's just basically feels like some tactile buttons push buttons alrighty so let's get this thing started up and we'll see how it runs hello
Alrighty guys, so my personal opinion on this car, it's not even worth getting for a toddler. Um, it's extremely slow, has no power, it barely moves, barely turns, um, and that's with brand new batteries in. It says full shocks, you don't even need the shocks, it doesn't even go that fast. You can run this thing straight into a wall and it doesn't even build up enough speed to break it. Um, the motor on it is extremely tiny, way underpowered. Um, the fact that it runs off of AA batteries is just another thing because, like, they just wear out too fast. Um, yeah, you could probably get 45 minutes out of it, but it'd be the most boring 45 minutes of your life. Um, my recommendation is to go and get something a little more expensive, something that runs a little better, um, preferably something with a rechargeable battery. Uh, something that goes a little faster than two miles per hour and uh, Yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and hopefully it keeps you from buying this and you know basically wasting your money on it um, Maybe I'll do some modifications to it and see if we can beef it up any later, but for now That's my review of this little RC car Thanks for watching